Hey guys, it's Mr. Blaze with a quick art tutorial. Today what I'm going to show you is a really fun lesson on learning all the different patterns that we can use for our Akuta animal project. For today's lesson, what you'll need a pencil or some colored pencils, a sheet of paper, some markers, colored pencils, crayons, any of the like. Now let's get started. All right guys, today we're going to practice different patterns that we can use for our Okuda animal project. Here's an example of Okuda's artwork. And what I want you to notice in here is that traditionally he uses these triangular sort of shapes in his artwork, but he does also use bands of color. Think of like a rainbow, um, as well as kind of gradations going from like an ombre of, you know, like a yellow. All right, now we're gonna begin the design process. And what I want you to do is to choose between color schemes. We can choose warm color schemes, yellow, orange, red, and all colors in between and around. Or a cool color scheme, same thing, all colors in and around. Or lastly, you could choose a rainbow color scheme. For the purpose of this video, I'm just going to choose a warm color scheme. So, you want to tell me, by first just dividing up your paper, in the top left, I'm going to type, or type, I'm going to write out, I'm not on a computer here, warm, that's my colors, and then you're going to just do a little color sample of each, so I, you, I know and you know. You can blend to the orange is kind of like a red. I don't know why. It's weird. And the red's like an orange. Isn't that funny? So now we're going to work on different types of patterns. Remember, Okuda had the bands and the triangles like we were talking about. So I'm going to give a few pattern ideas. Don't be limited to just these patterns. Feel free to experiment. So let's say we did a um, band. Band referring to like a rainbow. So you could have bands like straight like that. You could have them like this, and I guess we could even compromise and have something like that, or something in between. Then what you're going to do is you're going to see what those colors look like that you use for your color scheme. This is just to get a snapshot of finished image without spending all the time in between. So you like an idea. Again, my red is kind of like an orange. Sorry about that. I think somebody got their colors mixed up at the factory. Now, you could do um, a triangle sort of pattern. 